question I want to ask you is as the co-founder of Monk Entertainment, I just want to explain to you guys how we've divided our responsibilities as co-founders. Um, so Viraj would obviously be kind of the overall CEO of Monk Entertainment. He's the head of operations. Uh, he gets the final say on all the key decisions, obviously. He uh, began the company. He ran it alone, you know, when there was no other person running the company. So he's the king of this organization. Uh, I'm primarily in charge of culture. I mentor the people who join into Monk Entertainment. Uh, overall, I set strategies for where the organization is headed. Uh, but if someone asks me, okay, wh what are the activities that Monk Entertainment does? Right. I'll always tell them, wait, speak to Viraj because he's more in the <laughs> loop about uh, these things. So Viraj, what does Monk Entertainment do? And how so, have we been able to create a, an office of like 25, 30 kids? So how it started is again, uh, we realized that we were already working with talents now. We were adding value, both monetary, brand wise, all of that. Uh, then we realized that, uh, wait, there's a gap. It's not just the talents who don't understand how to work with brands, but it also is the brands who don't understand how to work with YouTubers, right? They don't know what are the right creators to work with. They don't know how to spend it. They don't know what are the market reach of these guys. They don't know what platforms to leverage. A lot of brands are not digitally equipped as yet. They don't know how what is a swipe up story. They don't know how to use a hashtag in a tweet. Yeah, I think for example. like people our age know these things better because we, we're the generation that's grown up with all this around us. Exactly. So it's a part of our daily life. I mean, social media was part of our daily lives. Yeah. I mean, you grew up, you bought a smartphone, you grew up in the smartphone age. Mm. Two top three apps that you've downloaded are essentially Facebook, Instagram, and probably Twitter or, I don't know, Snapchat. So we know, we use these on a daily. So naturally, we know how this works. A lot of the elder people, uh, people who are running organizations, who are CMOs, CXOs in these companies, they're not so well versed with it because they don't use it on a daily, right? So to cut it short, what we do is we work with brands, uh, to help them understand how to work with talents. We work with talents to make them understand how we can work with brands. And in all of this, we also basically do uh, everything else that comes on digital, like social media management, video production, everything content related is what Monk Entertainment looks at so that all of it can, can come under one umbrella. So yeah. tomorrow, if a brand comes to me and says that I have X amount to spend on content, I can tell them, okay, these are the talents you should work hmm. with. These are the platforms you should work on. This is the branded content you should make beyond using influencers. And this is how you should maintain your social media pages. Yeah, yeah. And we can do all of that for you. This is like your one-stop exactly. shop. Exactly. Chapter 6. How you learned all this? So, uh, also a lot of y'all might be looking at this video and saying, Are, how did y'all figure all these things? It was one step at a time. It began just with influencer marketing. In, in fact, it began just with managing me. Then it went to influencer marketing. Then we started helping brands with other, you know, influencer campaigns, digital campaigns. Then we figured, okay, wait, brands need social media. So we began a social media unit in the organization. So it was just one step at a time. Don't ever let these business stories you know, overwhelm you. Like, you know, I used to get overwhelmed when I used to read Same. all these business stories. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. And a lot of the stuff you read on the internet and uh, newspapers and all of that is, when you read them, make sure you read through the lines. Because mm. a lot of the times these figures are bloated. Mm. That X company got a hundred billion valuation, a one billion dollar valuation. All of that is all right. You need to see that what is the company's core problem solving agenda. Like, what is the problem they're solving? Ola at the end of the day takes you from point A to point B. So they are making sure that they solve your problem of traveling. Mm. Airbnb is making travel fun. Like they are giving you an experience, for example. What is it that we do? We make sure that agencies or brands lives are made easier by being the one-stop solution in terms of digital solutions. Yeah. That's what the model is. Now, how do you scale up from that is you build a team around it, you network, you work with more brands, they will recommend you, you to other brands. Your work speaks at the end of the day. That's really all.